يد محمد علي yes, question number 10 if i was a wise move good Ahmed Atiyah, number 11. Yes, sir. Yes. Number 11. Will the ball drop drops if I move this drop? Job well done. Was. Yes. Good. Good. If he use will use uses a compress, will he get lost? If he use. Correct if he uses. Person simple, we add S with he, she, and it. Yes, okay. Amr Magdi. Mustafa Hani. Yes, Mr. 13. If you put the magnet here, huh? The metal ball, the metal ball, uh, will move. Excellent. Omar Kamal, 14. Again, please. Will the water be cold? This is the answer. Thank you. Omar Mu'min, 15. Okay. What will we see if we mix That's all right. This? What will we see? Thank you. Question number one. Okay. Don't eat too much. No. You feel ill if you eat too much. Is this your answer? Yes. Okay. Look here, students. If in the middle, because here, if was a small letter. And look carefully. There's no comma between the two clauses because if in the middle. Mr. In L, Mr. In L, no, in L, not L. L. It's L. Not, not, it's I, not you, teacher. Read you and write I. Thank you. You're welcome. Ahmed Atiya. Yes, teacher. Number two. Stop talking in the class or teacher will be angry with you. If you talk in the class, the teacher will be angry with you. Well done.
Amr Magdi. Number three. If. I hope the weather will be good tomorrow. We want to go out. If the weather. Make this present simple, Amr. Um. Your verb is verb to be. Choose M or is or are with the weather. What will you choose? I mean, if the weather is or M or are. Weather is singular, it takes is. And this sentence, the future. Yes, sir. Number four. Number four. Ahmed, when the race, if will run very quickly. Again, please. Ahmed win the race. If will run very quickly. That's it. Yes. Look at your sentence carefully, please. Okay. Now, after if we use present simple, right? Right. There's if, there's after if. It is not present simple now, it's a future. You have to make it present simple. I speak about this part after if. If here comes in the middle, after if, I mean this part, must be present simple. Can you change it? Yes. Yes, go ahead, please. This is future. If. Will plus infinitive is future. You have to make this future present simple. So you have to cut will. Okay. Now, if run very quickly, who, run, who runs very quickly? He. Okay. Now, in present simple, can we say if he run? No, runs. Yes. So, Ahmed wins the race. Now, the first clause is correct. If he runs very quickly, present simple. Now, let's go to the second clause. It must be will plus infinitive. Can you see well here? Will. Yes. Where is it? Ahmed win the race. Can you see Will? No. So, so we must put Will here. Can you put Will, please. Ahmed will win the race. That's it. Thank you. You will. Yad Muhammad Ali, number five. Yes, teacher, I'm Ahmed Mustafa. Hello. I am Ahmed Mustafa. Hello, Ahmed Mustafa, number five. If mom, if mom asks here, will she? Again, please. If mom Ask. 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 Here. Ask. Will. Will she was.
the dishes. If mom us here. Ahmed Mustafa, look at Will here. Is it capital letter or small letter? Capital. This means we should start with Will. We can't start with if because he writes Will in capital letter here. Can you start with Will? Will. Yes. Will if Will if mom ask is this your sentence? It is not correct. Ahmad Mustafa, what you need to do in this sentence is don't change anything in the sentence. Okay, don't change anything. All you need to do is to start with will. Change the sentence into question. The answer okay. is yes. You cut the answer only. And the start with will. Try again, please. Well, she was the dishes. That's right. Continue. Uh, if mom asks me here, here, if mom asks here. Is this a question? Is this a question? Yes. At the end of the question, what should we put? What should we put at the end of the question? Most not. That's not correct. We don't put apostrophe at the end of the question. I know, teacher. I don't know. Quickly, Ahmed. At the end of the question, we put what? We put question mark, Ahmed. Adam Arif. What teacher? Number six, please. If the bus will be till the they talk, they will talk taxi. If the bus yes. will be till late, they will take a taxi. Adam Ar, now you have a problem in this sentence. You put will plus infinitive here and you put will plus infinitive here. You put future here and you put future here. And this is not correct. The first clause after if must be present simple, not future. The second clause is okay. It is future and it is correct. The problem here in the first clause, it must be present simple. If the bus will take, will tell. B. It, B is okay. B is okay. The problem in will. When you change it from future to present, you have to cut will. Will is future. We don't need it here. So we will cut will. Now we have verb to be. Bus and the verb to be. What should we put here? Am or is or are? If the bus am late or is late, oh, are late. Again, verb to be with but is. is, that's right. So the answer must be, if the bus is late, then you will take a taxi. Thank you, Ed.
Was? Yes. Seven. Don't play in the street to be safe. If we can't start with if, remember it is a smart well, well. Well, go ahead, continue. Well, the street don't be don't be safe. Yes. Continue, don't worry. We can change later. Continue. Don't waste the time, please. Continue and we can change the answer. If you... Play... That's it. Do you need to add anything? If you, if you play in the street. Now this is the center. Will the street don't be safe? This is not correct. If you play in the street. Now the condition, the condition here is you don't play in the street. If you do, the result will happen. You will be safe. Now, if you... we can't, okay, let's start with if, start with if, what would you, what would, what do you want to say? If? If you want to be safe, if you want to be safe. You you, you don't. You don't. Play in the street. Play in the street. Now we have a problem here. The problem, two problems. Number one, if in capital letter, and you write it here in a small letter, it must be in the middle. Number two, you put present simple here and the present simple here. We need present simple here and the future here. Can you think of anything else? Okay. Let me ask you a question. He said here, don't play in the street, okay. be safe, right? Yes. What will happen if he plays in the street? Will he be safe or he won't be safe? He won't be safe. That's it. So we can say here, if you, you won't, here we say you won't, be safe. Okay. Okay. Hey. Now, I think you want to be safe. You want to be safe is the result clause. It comes after if clause. So we can't put if here. We have to erase if from here. And we put it, want... we put it here in the middle. We won't be safe if you play in the street. That's it. Now let's think again. You want to be safe, future, if you play present simple, if in the middle, small letter. After if a present simple, the second clause is future. This is correct sentence. Thank you. So I have another sentence. Okay, but we wasted a lot of time here and we answered this before also. Ahmed Adli. 
Yes. Number yes. eight. Number eight. Okay. Eat fruit and vegetables, or you will be ill. If you if you eat fruit and vegetables. Yes, if you eat fruit uh, and vegetables. You don't want Yes. Uh, Negative. Negative. Negative, okay. Negative. You, 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 you won't be That's ill. Thank you. By the way, this is called the comma. It's not apostrophe. Apostrophe is up okay. here, right? Thank you. Medical okay. Thank you. Yes. Number nine. No, he want to walk to school if the bus comes. All you need to do here, Malik, is to finish the sentence. Wait. Okay. Will he walk to school if the bus uh, comes soon? That's right. Thank you. Will he walk to school if the bus Medic sad. Yes, Mr. Jin. Okay. Okay. Mom. Mom, help. Help me. With my, with my homework, if, if it's, uh, if it difficult, it's difficult. This is if here. After if a present is simple, right? Mali, after if in this part we use present simple, right? Malik, are you here? Or should I move to another student? I yes. I am asking you. Mom. After if we use present simple, is this right? Yes. Now we have it here and we have it, the subject, and you have difficult and adjective. There's no verb. Like the Where is the verb? Uh, like Where did you cut the verb is? Okay. Cute. Uh, mom, help me with my homeworks. Ahmed Adli, close your microphone. I am speaking about this part, uh, Malik. After if, if it difficult, something important is missing here. The verb is missing in your sentence. Okay, Malik Saad seems to be not ready. So I will move to another one. Ahmed Mustafa. Yes, teacher. Look at this sentence. Can you answer it? Mom helps me with my homework when it's difficult. Can you answer this sentence? Yes. Answer. If. We can't start with if. 
if is in is a small letter it should it must come in the middle okay mom okay will yes will help well done me with my homework when we cut when and when we it... what we replace when with if we use if instead of when we will not write when we will write if 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 difficult difficult Ahmed. Yes. The first sentence is very good. Mom will help me with my homework. The second the clause is wrong. You write only if and the adjective. We need a sentence here. We need subject and the verb and present. When if we will not use when. If. We will not use when. If instead of when. We replace when with if. I am speaking about after if. What should we write? When. When? Okay, when is wrong. Think well, again. well, well. When is wrong. Think again. Will is here. We write will here. Future. We need present simple. Thank you, Ahmed Mustafa. I move to another student. Mustafa Hani. Yes, um, yes, what should we write here? Mom will help me with my homework, it's okay. But if difficult, this is not correct. If it's difficult. That's right. It is a subject, it is a verb, and it is in present simple. And this is a if clause. That's right now. Thank you. We take turns. This is lesson three. Mister, I say it. What? I say it. You said you said it. Yes, not I, it. I didn't hear you. Now listen, three students. I need you to repeat the words. Not all the words, of course. Only the new words. Force is okay. Yes, this is this word. Friction. Repeat, please. Friction. Do you know what is yeah. friction, students? No. No. Yes, it's... Your, yes, you know. What is it? You are not sure. It's okay. Now, contact forces. Repeat. Mister, I know it. When you did two mm -hmm. things and they, and they make it uh, like this. Like this. Like this? See in camera. In camera. Thank you. I have a video about this. Now friction, contact forces. I need you to do. I need you to read this word. Contact forces. Contact forces. Handle. Handle. Magnetism. Magnetics. Cart is Magnetism. okay. Push is okay. Movement. Movement. Tita, we take lesson three. Excuse me? Anyway, pull. We have to take pull. 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 We have to take lesson three, teacher. We, we finished lesson three? Yes. Yes, we finished lesson three. Mm. Are you sure? No, 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 we didn't finish. Are you sure? Yes, no. we finished lesson three. You are sure that no. we finished lesson we finish three? We finished it. 
we finish it. We take it. Yes, we finish. We talk it. Finish. Okay. No, we didn't finish it. I am sure. But we, we didn't. I am, do I, am the... sure, I am sure we didn't take lesson three. Yes, we didn't take it. I am sure we didn't take it. Anyway, speed is okay. Mr. I, Mr. I, uh, I have a question. Go ahead. What, what is the handle? What is the difference between uh, the current shop? I can't hear you two together at one time. What was what do you want to say? What was your question? Okay. What what is the difference between store and shop? I don't know. Okay. 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 This is type. Slow down. Slow down is easy also. Object. Bring. Do you know what is the meaning of bring? Yeah. I bring a book. I perform the library. I brought my bag. To yes, school. yes, I know it. I know it. Okay, car, happen, store, stop. Repeat this word. Move forwards. Move forward. Start. Start. Move away. Move away. This is change is easy. Now force. Force means strength. Or force means energy. Force means energy. Contact forces. Contact forces are forces that comes because of pushing or pulling or friction. This is contact what means forces. friction. I have a video about friction. I think you should see the video before we continue these words. Because a lot of words are new for you. Let's start with friction. Let me share the video with you. Hey guys, today we'll learn about friction. Let's start learning about friction. Rewind back, zoop! When you were sliding, two objects were rubbing against each other, the slide and your body. A force occurred due to this. Friction is a force that holds back the movement of a sliding object. That Did you get that, students? Did you get what is the meaning of friction now? No, no, no. I didn't hear. I didn't hear. Don't eat that. But yeah. can you no. tell me the mic? The mic. We, yes, I can. Listen to this part again carefully. Everybody, a force occurred due to this. Friction is a force that holds back the movement of a sliding object. No. This boy sat on the slide here, right? And he went to that one. Yes. Is it right? Yes. This boy has weight, right? Maybe 50 yeah. kilograms or 40 kilograms, whatever. Okay? Excuse me? Good boy. 